So I'm getting ready to stream Endwalker right now. Just actually start and stream it and finally start playing. Decided to go a Reaper. So I'm going to be streaming it like now. But I wanted to get ready for that by releasing this reaction that I did on stream ages ago to the to the Endwalker trailer. Let's uh let's finally end this arc, shall we? I'm 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 a little nervous, y'all. I'm a little nervous. Like, you know? What if I hate it? What if I'm like, oh that looks bad. I don't want to play that. Oh, we. Dude, this is like a like a 90s song that I Oh, that's that's just a cool way of doing that. I knew we were going to the moon. The final days were upon us. The fabric of the star had begun to fray. Its land rent by tooth and claw. My adopted children! Oh my god, Alphino turns into a sage? Tiamat? Who is that? Holy shit. Was that wasn't that the first? Holy shit, Charlene looks so good. What the hell?
keep its council while the world is lost to ruin. It would. Come what may, we shall live on. We must. Do as you must, then. But we Scions will fight. Until the heavens fall. Until our last breath. Oh yeah, I'm going Paladin then. All right, cool. God damn! I don't know who that was narrating though. I think I know who it is. I think it's... Um, see, I don't want to say anything because I don't want somebody to confirm or deny it. It's, it's Tataru with a voice changer. I, it's either, it's either a Litibus or it's Emmett Selk after he reveals himself as Hades. Because it's not Emmett Selk. Like the, the, or if it is, he's doing something like raspy with his voice. Clearly Ghostface using a voice modulator. Like it, it kind of sounds like, well, no, a little, no, it's not a little bit because a little bit has like a, like a older, um, see that I actually really liked a little bit's voice because it had like an older quality to it, like a, uh. I don't want to say wiser, but like it had that tone to it. Like it sounded like an older, older man. I think, I think it's Hades or Emmett Selk when he reveals that he's Hades, which is interesting because he says, Oh, because he's not talking about it. Is, it's Hades and he's not talking about what's currently happening. He's talking about the end of his days, the fi actual final days. That makes sense. Okay, I was like, why is he being... No, it's because it's him talking about his final days. His world's final days. That's cool. That's 100% who it is. That doesn't really... If that's, if that's what they said, if that's what that person said, um, then, then yeah, don't, don't ban them. Because I, I, think that's, I think that's actually... I think that's fairly obvious. Or I'm a genius. Either one. Okay. Uh, no, don't tell me because I don't. I don't think. I don't think that's. Um, is this the one from the official page? Yeah. Uh, it sounds like they're saying Vitra, and I'm assuming that whoever that whoever his dragon companion is, we will. You you have to find out like the rest of us had to. Yeah, I mean he definitely says he says the dragon's name. Vitra? This song is so good. This is so, um, uh, Garland, Final Fantasy IX, uh, Terra, Lunarian. Like, this is so, so, I love it. I love it. That's just his pet name for Nidhogg. They've grown pretty... Nidhogg's back!
Yeah, that's the Stormblood thing, right? They have the different... What is that? The stage is set. But will our heroes deign to play their part? I'm worried about... I'm worried about, like, Xenos being a villain throughout 6.0. It's Devin's Lunar Whale. It looks like the, it kind of looked like the Lunar Whale. You don't want me to spell for you. It's, it's with Estinian and Dragon. You'd, oh no. Yeah. I got the, it's going through. I don't hear an answers though. Unless that's supposed to be what the first part is supposed to be calling, calling homage to. Where I think this is the first, I think this is Ulmore. You took your time. I think this is, this is um, uh, Gate Town. The this land was but Keep watch. I watched it already. The end draweth nigh. I know that it doesn't. It looks like it's. It looks like it's the same. But like everyone's dressed so brightly. I don't know. Maybe it's not. Well, more. Because that kind of looks like it's, uh, I mean, it looks like a free city of some kind, right? Like, um, uh, like a free trade city. Oh, I think they've, uh, they talked about it before. The East Aldernar, um, that comp, the, uh, they, tr uh, that company trades with them. It was totally talked about in Stormblood, for sure. They mentioned, they mentioned how they trade with them. Um, it's talked about a lot more in crafting quests and side quest. It's, I, it's a, it's a market city. Um, they, I, they for sure, they, they've definitely talked about it. I just don't, I do not recall the name of it. Not that, that, not that it really matters. He predicts some of the most ridiculous stuff. It's fun when he's actually stumped. Okay. I have not called everything. I, I feel everything I've called has been pretty, pretty pretty much in right there right like what's what's like the most ridiculous thing i've i've i called i was gonna say i called the asahi thing but that was easy fan daniel evil evil alfie well i originally thought he was evil alfie and then i and then i was like wait a minute that smile and that voice acting that wasn't that e oh come on i think that was i think that was that wasn't that hard either a few things, but I'll wait until you finish that. That's <laughs> a good point. Yeah, don't you're right. Don't call that out. I do think I'm right about that lady, though, at the end of Shadowbringers. That's like the light is here now. Um, she's definitely an ancient, and I am I am willing to bet uh my buttocks that she is Hydalin and that her title was Venonat. I think her title was Venonat and her actual name is Hydalin and we call her Hydalin. Oh, those enemies. Very, very cool stuff. Uh, oh man. Oh man, y'all. I'm, I'm very excited for Endwalker.